it's been a couple weeks since I uploaded my last video. So I wanted to give you a quick update on what's coming next today and next week. So right after I post this video or soon after I post this video, I have a long video, probably close to a half hour long, talking about a little bit about my journey through the film cameras I've tried. Um, I try to keep it succinct as possible, but yet get some of the key points that I wanted to talk about. But I know I missed stuff, so it's going to be an ongoing conversation that I will record more videos for. Um, this video is a also kind of a welcoming video because I've gained more followers in the past two months than I have in a long time, um, more at a rapid pace. And I hope that all the video, I hope that all the followers I have so far have enjoyed some, if not most of the videos I post. I wanted to give a welcome video to the new subscribers and anyone who might be finding this video to give somewhat of a welcome video and describe about a little bit about what I do on this channel and what I'm going to continue to do in general terms. So obviously as a photography channel, I intended to make this a filmmaking channel too, but I think filmmaking video editing might go on its own channel at some point. So this is photography stuff and I shoot with Right now I shoot uh, all my digital stuff on Fujifilm cameras. I have an X-T1, which is um, probably the camera I shoot most with right now. Um, right now it has a uh, FD 28 millimeter lens that I adapted to it. And film photography wise, I shoot a lot of film. Um, this year I'm trying to shoot a lot more film than I did last year, because last year I got into a mode where I was shooting the X-T1 so much that I rarely picked up a film camera. And that's not a bad thing at all. But another thing I started to do last year was make prints in the darkroom. So I wanna um, shoot with this camera a lot more, the, can the, the Nikon F3, which I just picked up again recently. And this amazing camera, I love this camera. So I, wa I want more good negatives that I can create something with in the darkroom. So I gotta make sure I incorporate um, more film photography on a regular basis this year in order to do that. So I'm bouncing between uh, digital and film on a regular basis, Fujifilm and the Nikon F3. So welcome to the channel. This is what this channel is about, rotating between digital Fujifilm stuff with the recipes and all these kinds of things and um, film photography. And I want to be talking a little bit more about the Nikon and some of the things I'm doing with it. So I hope you stick around and I figured <laughs> there's actually a couple of the most recent darkroom prints I made. This shot was shot with this camera setup. I can't remember what this one was shot with, but um, I'll show more darkroom stuff later. But welcome to the channel. Let me know if you have uh, some photography related subjects you want me to talk about. Go through my archives of videos and see if there's anything that interests you. If you have, an, uh, if you have a recommendation for a recipe. Let me know if you have some uh, tutorials or things you want to talk about in that regard. Let me know that as well. So thanks for joining the channel. Thanks for checking out this video and uh, connect with me on Instagram or let me know in the comments where I can connect with you. So check out the video I'll post next about uh, film cameras, my film camera journey, and then return next week for another Fujifilm film simulation recipe that I created on my X-H1. So thanks again for watching and I'll talk to you soon. <music>